Um, to shift gears a little bit, you know, we're going to move towards questions geared for sales leaders, right? Let's say you're a little bit further in the process. You've hired either a VP of sales or a sales director to manage those five, 10 AEs. Um, based on your experiences, when have you, I guess, how, when is the right time to scale? I think people raise money and get that pressure almost immediately. What do you think the right time is uh, based on those two organizations you worked for? Yeah, and I, I think it's um, you know, probably Offer Pop is is uh, is, a, is probably the best example of that. And I think because we really put the pedal to the metal, and I think a couple things need to happen. Number one is is you know if you're going from a handful of reps called three to five, and you're going to double or triple quadruple the sales team. Like number one, you better have your sales process fairly baked, um, as you're going to be adding a lot of volume to the to the team. And then I think as you go about scaling. Um, and there's like some things that we did very well and some things we did not do very well. Um, but as you scale, like I think it's really important to go through the exercise of doing the, the uh, total addressable market. Um, how do you get there, right? Like if I'm going from five reps to 15 reps, what like it's not just enough to do, you know, have your uh, C, uh, CFO say, hey, we need to go from Five million in sales to 15 million in sales, so we're gonna, you know, the three x the sales team. Um, you have to also go bottoms up, and I think that's something that we um, we didn't do early enough, um, but certainly we 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 did, you know, later down the road. In the sense that, like, if you are going to hire 10 more salespeople, where do their leads come from? Who generates them? Is the market big enough? Are there are there enough leads to 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 support 10 more salespeople? Uh, I think these are all questions that sometimes are difficult to answer, and sometimes you kind of have to you have to guesstimate a bit. But it's super, super important to have that have that data and and map that from from both sides' perspective. And and I've just seen just from you know paying attention to the industry, there have been a lot of businesses that have primarily around Series B that raise a bunch of money that want the the chart to kind of keep going like this. And it's like okay, we're gonna we're just gonna like you know quadruple the sales team. And it turns out the math is wrong, and uh, you see, you know, a lot of layoffs. Some CEOs are not CEOs anymore. Like, you know, it's, it, it's because, like, I look at it, and it's like, shit, they didn't do the bottoms up measure. So